Aloha. I'm Eric Anderson, pastor of Church of the Holy Cross, United Church of Christ in Hilo, Hawaii. And here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking about the 15th chapter of John's Gospel, part of Jesus' farewell address to his disciples at the Last Supper. We find a familiar theme Last week's reading in the first letter of John, in chapter 5, the theme was love. Here in the 15th chapter of John's Gospel, the theme is love. Love one another as I have loved you, said Jesus. You are my friends if you do as I command you. I have called you friends because the servant does not know what the master is doing. Love here is not romantic love. First century Greek, which John used to write the gospel, had different words for different kinds of love, and this is not the romance word. No, the love that is described here is a love that involves cost and sacrifice when one loves in this fashion, one does so despite what it may cost the person who is doing the loving. So this is the kind of love that gives money to someone who needs it. This is the kind of love that will incline one to take a risk. This is the kind of love that took Jesus to the cross. Love one another as I have loved you. It is not a light and easy commandment. What it is, is the standard for Christian life. When we act unlovingly, we are not behaving as one of Jesus' friends. When we do love, then we show what Jesus' friends are, can be, should be. So go love someone today. Love as many people as you can. Help someone who needs something. Comfort someone who's in distress. Give somebody the skills and the confidence that they need in order to succeed. Lift someone up who has suffered a failure. Love someone. Love lots of someones. Be a friend of Jesus. That's what I'm thinking. I'm curious to hear what you're thinking. Send me an email or leave me your thoughts in the comments section below. I'd love to hear from you. From Church of the Holy Cross, UCC in Hilo, Hawaii, that's what I'm thinking.